While most of the relationships within Love Island are constantly changing, fans have become accustomed to the constant drama that surrounds them. Donnie and Jack Finch have found romance early on in the villa and it has continued to blossom throughout the show so far. But one couple has stolen the hearts of the nation. Although they hit a road bump last month when Allie Jones, Jack's ex-girlfriend, arrived on the scene. Despite the show's producers sending Donnie a video of Jack realizing his girlfriend entered the villa, the couple stayed strong when the two villas were reunited. However the popular couple may be dipping in popularity, as data has emerged surrounding the amount of tweets sent during the show. Data from company We Are The Romans revealed the most tweeted about Islanders during last night's episode. And it looks like Donnie has slipped in popularity as she comes up ninth on the list. Above only Haley Hughes. Donnie's endearing relationship with Jack may have left fans wanting more from the pair. With Donnie's popularity winning, is her position in the show in danger in the weeks to come? Meanwhile Drive This could be due to a struggle to gain a consistent partner in the villa. Alex George still tops the board as the most popular. But will his new partnership with Grace Ward will be the start of a new relationship? Meanwhile Megan Barton and Adam Collard take the third and fourth spots in tweeting popularity respectively. This follows Adam's fleeting relationships which have left a multitude of women feeling cheated by him. Megan has gained infamy during her stay in the villa after also changing her partner throughout the show. Georgia didn't appear on the rankings, but she is sure to get people talking after her shocking betrayal by Josh Denzel last night. She confessed to the beach hut, how could Josh do that to me when I've been so loyal to him? Later Josh spoke out about the relationship, saying, I just want the opportunity to tell her that I didn't think this would happen. Love Island continues tonight at 9pm on 2.